developing election story right now, Amendment 64, the statewide ballot measure to legalize marijuana in Colorado approved by voters tonight. Despite a long list of Colorado politicians against this measure, numbers still coming in. But as you can see right there, a resounding yes, 53% to 47%. And 7 News reporter Lindsay Sablon with supporters of Amendment 64. Still a lot of questions, Lindsay, about how this will be implemented since it's a federal crime to possess marijuana. Yeah, this is the first step with Amendment 64, but the federal government could still take the Supreme Court. But supporters here at Castleman's Bar tell me that's probably not going to happen. They say it would be a bad move for the government to go against the American people who voted for Amendment 64 here in Colorado and also the Americans that are voting in Washington and Oregon today for similar ballots. And I want you to take a look behind me. Kind of dying down, but still partying nonstop since 7 o'clock. Again, those numbers not all the way in here in Colorado, but vote no on 64 conceded earlier today, and they had their speech saying this has been a long time coming. Now, just kind of the nuts and bolts of this, this legalizes marijuana for adults 21 and older. It also allows them to possess up to an ounce of marijuana. Also, it's going to voter um, decided tax which could raise, some supporters say, up to $120 million in the first five years. The other thing it will do is in January 2014, it will allow stores to sell this. Now, Governor Hickenlooper has to sign this within the first 30 days, so we'll see what happens from this point forward. Live in Denver, Lindsay Sablon, 7 News. Seven